I do a video that I have on my list of videos that I want to do for you guys. It is a DIY ripped jeans video. Those of you who do not know me, I'm actually a budget girl and I'm actually one of those people that like to save money. So I like to thrift and all that good stuff. So with no further ado guys, I am going to show you my jeans. I actually bought on a budget. I bought them at the thrift store that I am always raving about and I got them for a dollar. These jeans are 365 jeans by Levi's and they're leggings and they're super cute. They're really snug and adorable, but they're boring guys. If they're boring, what are we going to do with them? We're going to rip them. So that's exactly what I'm going to show you right now. So with no further ado, here comes the video. All right guys. So what you're going to need for this DIY are some scissors, some tweezers, a pen, and of course, your jeans. These are the Levi jeans that I told you guys about. They're 365 uh, Levi's leggings. They're legging jeans, so they're really snug and they're off skinny jeans. So let's get on with the video, shall we? All right, guys. So I have my jeans on right now. And what I like to do is wear them because that way I can tell and I can see where I'm going to draw the line. I'm just going to grab my pen. So what you want to do is, I mean, it depends on where you want to cut your jeans, but I want to do them just above the knee. Um, if you want to do them at the knee, you want to do it just above the knee, so that way you have some leg room to walk, and with the normal wear and tear, it doesn't tear m more than what it should, and that way it just tears comfortably above your knee. So I'm going to draw a line right here. I want it to be right here, guys. And I want to do two tears. So I'm going to draw two lines. So this is where I want my cuts. All right, guys. So now I'm going to take off the jeans and I'm going to show you how I cut them and how I make them look all washed out and everything, okay? So instead of paying $85 for some ripped jeans, guys, pay $1 at the thrift store or get some old pair of jeans and make them your own. We'll see you in a bit. Alright guys, so now that we have them on the floor and ready to go, what we're going to do is cut them. Easy breezy. So you're going to fold them upwards and you see the line here. So if you see the line, this is where the line is right here. So we're just going to cut them until the line ends on both sides and you're just going to use your scissors to cut them. And that's it guys. And Okay, so drawing the line was an epic fail because it did not cut at the line. I cut it a little above. Great. But there's that rip. See that rip? Now we're going to do the other leg and fold it upwards. Fold it to where you see the line here, guys. You see the line? God, this lighting is terrible. All right, there you go. So then we're going to cut it. And you can cut it as long as you want, as short as you want. <laughs> These are your jeans, guys, so you can do whatever you want with your jeans. There are no limits. The sky is the limit as far as how you want your jeans to look. So now that you have these cuts, here comes the fun part, all right? What we're going to do is we're going to grab all the blue threads and we're going to pull them down with the tweezers. Now you can use your fingers or you can use your your tweezers. It doesn't matter. But what you want to do is pull pull them out. All the blue ones, pull them out until you start to see them looking really washed out. All right guys, so I don't know for some reason my battery died, so it cut off the most important part of the tutorial, which is getting these blue threads off. So I cut both slits and I started using the tweezers and I started getting out all the blue threads out from the top. And so then that's what I did. So see you guys, this is the end result. And then I will show you, um, the next clip is going to be how I cut the slits on each side to have the end result. 
Then what you want to do is grab like if you have a pumice go ahead and get your pumice guys But I don't have a pumice and I just thought about this right now I went ahead and went outside and grabbed a rock with my son and This rock is awesome. It's perfect for what I'm about to do for that distressed look on the jeans you just rub this all over the, uh, the ripped part and it's going to give it that awesome distressed look so before you grab a rock guys make sure you wash it I washed it with soap and hot water and then I just kind of dried it up with a dirty towel and made sure that there were obviously no bugs or dirt on it because then I mean it's okay if you have to wash your jeans I mean I think the best thing is to wash the jeans after this um, but right now I'm actually going to put them on, but yeah, so the, I already started it here, so as you can see, with the rock, and it's working perfectly, so let's just keep going. Oh, it's still dirty. Okay, well, I'm going to wash them anyway, so it doesn't really make a difference. So guys, what you want to do is just rub, rub, rub until you get desired distressed look that you want. So guys... I think this is it for me. Like, I like it like this. And I'm going to put them on. And now I'm going to do the other leg. So, as you can see, this one is just ripped. And it doesn't look authentic. As authentic. So, I'm going to go ahead and give it the distressed look. Son is playing with princess. I think with princess, guys. You are, baby. Yes. All right, guys. So this is good. Like I actually wanted it a lot wider, but like I said, this is going to the normal wear and tear is going to widen them up eventually. So this is a good amount of size for the jeans to start, and then. They'll widen up by themselves with a normal wear and tear. Alright guys, so this is my distressed look. And I'll see you guys in a bit with them on. Alright guys, so these are the jeans, the finished look. And you can pretty much pair them with cute platform uh, shoes and just a basic tee. And I got this at Five Below, this t-shirt. And it says, all I care about is pasta and like three people. This is Princess, everyone, our rescued kitten. Um, and yeah, so these are my jeans, guys. This is all it took. All it took was ripping um, as how I showed you and distressing them with a rock if you don't have a pumice. Okay, my cat is like really sticking to my shirt. Hey guys, so this is it for this video. And if you enjoyed this, our uh, DIY ripped jeans, give it a big thumbs up, guys, to support my channel. And be sure to subscribe and red button below. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I love you guys so very much, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.